about the head. There's something I just want to chip in there. Okay? So if you want to wash the head, you know babies are very sensitive. When you pour water, make sure you just when you put the soap, make sure you use your hand to be pushing it backwards so, so that it doesn't enter baby's eyes. Do you understand? Uh -huh. So don't just say you are pouring soap, you pour water and you are like the, like an adult. Make sure you're using your hand to push it back. So when you are pouring water, the same thing. So that soap, just to avoid soap from entering baby's eyes. Now, like Mitchell already explained earlier, the umbilical cord is a connection between the mother and the baby. That supplies also the nutrients, blood, oxygen to the baby. When the baby is in the womb. All right. So the cord usually falls off within seven to ten days. It dries up. So you don't you don't damp. Hmm? You actually clean. clean. You actually use it to clean because some mothers will tell you they look at the cord and they will feel ah, it's too fragile. It will be paining the baby. Does it and they ah, it does not. It doesn't. You actually clean. You don't damp. The reason is if you don't clean properly, it could get infected. Okay, it could get infected. Because it's an open skin, so you actually need to clean. And the more you clean with spirit, spirit dries it off, it makes it shrink, and then eventually it falls off. So after that, we go to the cord itself. We want to clean in a straight manner. And once, just one movement. Do you know that Just using this as an example. Yeah. Right? Straight. One stroke, drop down, take another one. One stroke, drop down, take another one. One stroke until it is clean. And that's it.